Hello and welcome everyone as we revel in the Hello, excitement, everybody. the welcome expectation the emanating from all corners of the ground. Undoubtedly for many a fan of Ligue 1, the happiest day of the year. New hope, new expectation. One really would struggle to find a place anywhere on the globe that is happier and more full of anticipation than this. This is one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Just getting hold of some day one team news. So any insights from you, Jim, as to what we might expect from the top level of French football this season? Well, the big issue is who can break the PSG dominance. Can anyone match them for their quality, their depth, if you're to stop uh, a much-expected procession? And already we're underway here. Giroud, a man who can do little wrong right now. Yeah, I think it's safe to say, Peter, that he's likely to be the... Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Well, it looked promising, but the final ball is just not quite right. Ramos. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. Sends it forward. Pass just lacking in accuracy. Casillas. Oh, what's he done? Has a look and has a go. Goal! Strasbourg! Yeah, they were made to pay for not moving the ball smartly enough through a very strong pressing wave. Strasbourg get themselves into the lead. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Aholu. Gamero is onto it in a flash. Well, I wouldn't quite advise they should resort to risk-taking at this stage. There's plenty of time left yet. Mbappe gets away from his opponents. Well, that is a good challenge from him. Niamsi. Now the breakaway. Oh, what a can he finish! Goal! And he's got what he came for, his 20th goal. Yeah, they've only got themselves to blame. Mistakes in those areas are very punishable. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, what a convincing response to going behind. They've got all the momentum now. Oh, good spread. He is through here. Delivery from Mbappe. Defending of the desperate variety. And the shot! The deftness of touch, received it delightfully and finished it off sumptuously.
Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Well, they're very much the better team. There's the whistle for half-time. Well, what a comeback. Certainly, I didn't see that coming, nor I think did many in this crowd. So, there was the first half. Well, Peter, I'm just thinking of the best way to describe that. Frantic, um, frenzied. It was unmissable and it was irresistible. Forget about the analysis on this one, just enjoy it. Very little in it. The score at half-time is two goals to one. The action has already resumed here. Maradona. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Now De Bruyne. Oh, nicely intercepted. Moved forward and quickly so. And they'll start all over again with the goalkeeper. Pique. Giroud proving dependable as ever. Another terrific day at the office for him. Well, not only can a player of such high calibre show the imagination to set up a goal, but he can also produce when the pressure's on to deliver a big moment. This guy was born to create. The attendance for this match Aholu. was 72,306. Made out towards the right wing. He's in plenty of space here. Great ball if he can get there. Corner then. They've played it short. And that's been leave it clear. Tries to get it clear. Strasbourg showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. They're coming again and again. Spot on, Peter. Now the counter. He's found a way through. Oh, that's a key interception. Shifted upfield. De Bruyne, always onto this. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Now then, the ball's come loose. Strasbourg needed that, they really needed it. Oh, that's brilliantly defended, though. It looked destined for a goal. Nice little ball through. Saka. He's gone direct here. Pierre Gabriel spots it and intercepts. They're avoiding the blatantly obvious by not getting the ball into the opposition box. That's where it has to be. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. What a match, what a comeback. That is how to respond to adversity. Truly deserving winners. Maradona voted man of the match, and deservedly so. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Look, a win's a win. Sometimes it's not as you'd like, but you have to find a way to produce what you need, and I thought and they did that. The moment we've all been waiting for. So it's many thanks to Jim Beglin.